Hi, I'm Jen Bjorn with the Bjorn Speech Sound Cues, and I've had lots of emails uh, for requests for a video for the hand cues that I use with all of my speech sound cues. So I thought I would go through the consonants and do a quick um, video tutorial on all the different hand cues I use. For the vowels, I use Pam Marshalla's place cues for her vowels. So you can find that on YouTube and I can put that link in the comments below. So I'm gonna just start and go through the pile and show you the hand cues I use. I've made all of these up. They seem to work great. Uh, if you have any other suggestions or ideas, I'm definitely open uh, for those suggestions. But the hand cues tend to help give kids another way to cue for the sounds and decrease our fade verbal cueing. Uh, okay, here we go. So our popcorn sound, pop, pop. I do a popcorn hand with my hands. Pop, pop. Our sheep sound, I usually touch my lips. Ba, ba. Our yummy sound, I'll rub my tummy. Mmm. Our TikTok sound, I usually take a finger and tick in the middle of my hand. T -t -t -t. Our drum sound, I'll either drum on a table or the floor or in my hand. D -d 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 -d. Our no no sound, uh, a lot of times I'll use the sign for no, n, or I'll go n, n, n. So either one, it just depends. Like if I'm working on the word s, no then the word no's in there. A lot of times I'll do this, but if I just need a n, then I'll do n, n, n. Our hot dog sound, I'll put my hand out. <sighs> Our fish sound, I will kind of grab um, my lips or um, I'll even sometimes give a tactile cue on their mouth for wuh, wuh, wuh. The yuck sound, uh, it's our yak that's eating a sock here. Um, a lot of times I'll just go yeah, yeah, or do the sign for Y, or I'll do yeah with my hand and kind of give a yucky face like yeah. Also with Y, I will take that long E vowel, our eating E, and I'll show them that to help facilitate that Y sound. So a lot of times I'll put that E out when we're working on yeah to do yeah. Mad cat. And just get my hands up and look like a mad cat. Our vacuum sound, I'll do a, a V with my hands and I'll vacuum my hand. V. Our coughing sound, I kind of touch under my chin. K -k -k. And then our baby sound, I will touch my throat because it's voiced and I want the kids to feel it. G, g, g. Snake sound. Finger down my arm. Zipper sound, zip up your coat. Zzz. Quiet sound, shh. Train sound, shh, shh. Hair dryer sound, j, 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 j. Do a little hair dryer like motion. Um, my singing lemur sound, I'll usually do La, 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 la. And for the truck sound, rrr, rrr, almost kind of like a motorcycle handle. Rrr, rrr. All right, and my two THs, my voiceless TH and my voice TH. Mm, don't have a cue for these, so if you have any ideas, we'd love to hear and share. Uh, but this one's the voiceless TH. His eyes are closed. A lot of times I'll use a video to give feedback for kids. His eyes are closed because it's quiet. And this little gal, she's got, um, her eyes are real wide open. She sees a bee and the bee's buzzing. So, but no cues for those. All right, if you have any questions or suggestions, ideas, comments, please leave them below. And I can't wait to hear from you.